Hey everyone, Shin Virtuality here, taking a look at Creative Destruction. So Creative Destruction is sort of like a Fortnite-like battle royale game. You get weapons and shields and whatnot, and well, you have a deconstructor weapon that you can get materials from dismantling buildings or trees or other structures in the game and use them to build ramps, build bridges, build structures, that sort of thing. Uh, it's pretty cool. Like, it's free to play on Android, I believe iOS and Steam as well. And I remember playing this game back when in the beta when it was under the name Fortcraft. So I'm kind of glad it sort of came out and got a name change because Fortcraft is rather, you know, oh it's Fortnite and Minecraft. So, eh. but still, it's a good game if you want something. Fortnite-like, but not exactly Fortnite. Uh, so, we'll hop into a match or two and just sort of take a look and see what uh, this thing is all about. Explorers! The Royal Valley is right below us. Intelligence reports that the West Wind Group has secretly entered the Aurora Valley ever since gold was discovered in the West Lake. Committed all manner of crimes and even attempted to occupy the whole West Lake. They are a threat to the safety of the inhabitants of Aurora Valley. Heroes of justice, ready your weapons. Put a stop to the West Wind. Become the Dawn Star and return peace to the Aurora Valley. Why are you dawdling? Pluck up your courage and wipe out the West Wind. Alright, we're gonna drop in and see what's going on. I tend to like the uh, canned voices for the airdrop ship. Because at least you don't have a lot of people just sort of screaming obscenities over and over like you do in some other games. But hey, we'll drop and we'll hopefully try and make it a little bit... a little bit farther try and get in some final circles and not get killed off right away. Uh, I don't play this all that often, so cross our fingers. Let's try and make it to the settlement. And then probably the zone will say, oh, no, go the other way. I want to try and get to a building here that would actually have some stuff available. Ammo, but no gun. Awesome. There we go. So at least we have something. Nope. Sometimes they have these statues for some, I guess, more uncommon or rare build materials. And then of course you can break up the structures for your own materials that you can use to build structures or upgrade great tools, that sort of thing. So far we're in the zone, so don't have to get going right away. But definitely need more stuff before. Come on. No. You have a build mode, you can build platforms or structures or bridges, whatever, whatever you need. Awesome.
And press the walls in your way, just break it down. Uh, Minimap's pretty good. It uh, detects gun when guns are being fired off or footsteps nearby, that sort of thing. That's a the yellow bar at the t upper left is representative of your shields, and of course you want to get them first because they're sort of your first line of defense. Another statue for more rare materials, I guess. Shields I see, and Uzi, so there we go, full shields. Oh, I already have one of those, so I'll take the Uzi for now. At least I'll have a submachine gun option. our inventory somewhat. Uh, then you can always go to your destructor weapon and well, there could be. So one of the things I always want to try and do is check for chests because there will be some about I have these guys. Blue Bump will take over my Uzi. I don't really do shotguns all that much, so. Chest. Miss that. Yep, I'm good with that. He's got a sniper option, so there we go. Pistol, submachine gun, machine gun, sniper. No, I'm liking where this is going. Still get some building materials for us. I think we're full of dumb bandages. Nope, we got it. We got it. Get the ground like that. We got here plasma SMG, and it's portable. You got the color system for loot, so of course, white, green, blue, purple, orange. And I think that order, uh, storm is right on us, and we have to go. sniper out in case we come across anyone in needing of dying. 
one of the nice things is that the map itself or at least the ground will actually have an outline of the circle when you get closer to it or at least it did so we'll see if it still holds true oh, just over there I'm gonna go for it. See if I can get there before the zone comes in. I should have enough time. About 30 seconds before. Before it do. So what we need is our constructor tool, the ramp, and um yeah, it looks good. Yeah, that looks good. is good and we're off again oh, another one and another one bites the dust Not be interrupted. Apparently, there's an airdrop coming. All right, so that's what I was saying. The uh, outline there on the ground is where the zone is, so I know I'm safe. Kind of cool to have, especially if you're in the heat of combat. Uh, and we are at the edge of the zone, but let's see if we can't see anybody. This one came in, we got 90, 80 some odd meters to go. Looking at for oh, 14 left. Oh, there's the pillars, those are your airdrops. So at least everyone knows where it landed. <clears throat> also another 30 seconds till the zone con comes in but let's see if we can't uh just close the distance some. Some building structures over there, so definitely someone was in that area. 
Of course, like most of these games, I expect to just get sniped. Oh, yep, there we go. and he's coming right for me so I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing sounds like he's Made it to the top five, and we know where one of them is. Yep, and here we go. One shot and it just kills me. And of course you can watch the rest of the game play out. Three left, so he's got to get two more kills. We'll see this one play out. go and that's the game not bad 
fifth place. Now let's see if we can squeeze another one in. Dear tourists, our air taxi is approaching the beautiful Aurora Valley. The Aurora Valley is a virtual world created by the Aurora Corporation. A wonderful place where visitors never want to leave. At least for the tourists that I've welcomed. So many people come and they never leave. Oh, another thing. The bunny and teddy plushies are popular souvenirs. Don't forget to remind the boss to give me my commission when you buy them. Bunny plushies. Got it. Getting close to our marker, so we'll just hit the jump and go. Um, all right. <laughs> and I potatoed right out of the plane, so... Already we got someone on us. Someone on us, and we don't even have a gun yet. Yeah, there we go. Before the zone comes in, let's go see what this digging prompt is asking us to do. And hopefully I can just deconstructor it. We got a ways. We got ways.
the scope at least. some bridges. And we're not doing so hot because we are still a ways from the zone. Time to mess around, so let's see if we can close the distance and hopefully get him. And of course you're in the zone and you take damage until you're out of it, which for me is still a little bit, come on, there we go. Oh. I know I should be probably using a full health pack here, but yeah, let's see what we can done here. Oh, those are traps. All right. So let's get into the next zone and see what is going down. Chest. We like chests.
All right, well, at least we're in the next safe zone before anything happened. underhanded tactic of hiding in the bushes, but at least it's a still a viable option if you need it. Pay no heed to the bush. Although my little hammer buddy is sort of floating out outside, so I would think that if someone was looking at my direction, they would see the clue of springboard so here's another tactic you can use So I'm shrinking four left, so I'm going to just hit the springboard and go in flying. These you can use this to cover some distances and Made it to top two. Come on.
I'm in the zone, he is not. Well, <laughs> meant to make it a little bit more exciting than to do that, but hey, number one. So what can you do? Uh, and then you can take a picture and send it off to social medias or view the highlights. There we go. So nice little little jaunt through the woods. Enjoy a meal in your bastion of steel. <laughs> I think they call it number one the Lone Star or Dawn Star in this. Anyway. Cool. So that was Creative Destruction. Hope you like like what you saw. If you do, pick it up. Anyway, this has been Chin Virtuality. Game on, have fun, and we'll catch you all in the next one. Thanks for watching. Yeah! yeah.